A stadium alive with atmosphere and two teams ready to commit themselves to excellence for 90 captivating minutes. We're privileged to be here on an occasion that resonates with football fans everywhere. And if you think you know who's going to win, you are courageous indeed. Next on EA TV. Hello everyone, our travels have taken us to southern France for this game, to the Stade Vélodrome. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It's France versus Germany. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Well, possibilities in the centre. A very timely interception. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Kingsley Coman starts with Usman Dembele in the wide positions. And lining up through the middle in attack today is Kylian Mbappe. Thomas Müller. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Mark Andre Ter Stegen in goal. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Niklas Zule at oh, the back. Oh, big moment here. There it is, and just the ideal start. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Has restarted 1 0 here. Benjamin Henriks, Jamal Musiala on to Zule. Making progress, but they took care of the situation defensively and threaded through by Mbappe. Can they convert? The game has been turned on its head. They have never stopped believing, and now they sense victory. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and Dembele's finish gives the keeper no chance. He hits it with such venom. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Emre Can. And he was in the right place to intercept. Gnabry. Could reduce the deficit. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. And played in by Kimmich. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Not the best clearance. Gnabry. Oh, that surely had to go in, but marvellous defending. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Benjamin Henrichs. Serge Gnabry. Trying to really get at the opposition here. And over the byline it goes. So a goal kick coming up here. 
Ibrahima Konate. Jules Kunde on the ball. Chouameni. Well, France couldn't hang on to it. Emre Can. And now here's Henrichs. And France have it back now. Mbappe. It's got to be. And a goal here. There it is. They've done it. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. And the action underway once more with France very much on top. Possession one. Well, they have the advantage. That's good refereeing. And beating the defender. Rabiot. And defensive play to be applauded. Aurelien Chouameni. Oh, he'll take it on. Terrific block. Gnabry. Muller. That was going in. Inching towards the interval, and it's going with home advantage. Stuart, as always, very keen to get your take. Well, when they play like this, they're such a good team to watch. Their passing, movement and finishing have been of the highest quality. If they continue to play at this pace for the rest of the game, who knows how many they could score. Good through ball. What can he do with it now? That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Envies on to Gunduan. Real chance. And still danger here. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Germany doing well to regain possession. Emre Can. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. Dembele. Aurelien Chouameni. And so there it is, the first half has come to an end here at the Orange Velodrome. All in all, he's been rather quiet, kept in check, Leroy Sané. Yeah, he's struggled to get on the ball in dangerous areas. You can argue the service hasn't been good enough, but I don't think his movement has been dynamic as it normally is. He certainly needs to improve here. Into the second half then. Will it be more of the same from France? They were breathtaking in the first 45, you've got to say. Are they capable of matching that in the second half? Good weight on that pass. And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. Not the best challenge, free kick.
He'll have a go here. It was an accurate free kick, but a fine save. Quick ball to perhaps catch them out. Still a chance. Oh my goodness, you've really got to praise the defending. That was top notch. Rabio. Nicely timed tackle. Rudiger. Musiala. It's with Gundogan. Kimmich. Rudiger. And a fine tackle. Rabio. Griezmann. Mbappe. Well, the fans want to see a shot. Still could be dangerous. Threat over for now, it seems. Well, Derek, this has been a really good performance, as you can see. They've created numerous chances, they're winning the game comfortably, and they could go on and score more. This could get really embarrassing. Zula. Gundogan. Jamal Musiala. Good piece of closing down. Musiala. Gnabry. Clean challenge. And foul it is then. Well, they've decided to make a change. was on the target but the keeper up to the task of saving it Konate Kunde Ibrahima Konate Teo Hernandez now excellent vision Dembele and thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. This could be dangerous if he's not careful. Pulls it back. Well, he knows what he's doing defensively. Rabio. How can he take them on and beat them? Mbappe. Might it be Mbappe? What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing, drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal. Well, here we can see it again, and no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tighter here, deal with the danger, otherwise that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Rudiger. Just straying offside. <laughs> Kimmich. Zane has it. Havertz. Can he finish? And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Yeah. 
playing it short. Kimmich. On to Muna. It opens up for Havertz. And he's kept it out. Fully stretched. Somehow reaching it. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. And they're making a change. Coman. What can he do with it now? Sané. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. The high press was on, and the chance is on. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at their best. Well, as you can see, what an excellent back heel this is to set up the goal. And from that sort of range, you'd be shocked if Gnabry missed out. He just keeps showing us what a top finisher he is. Goals in plentiful supply. 4-1 currently. Eduardo Camavinga. Well, keeping the ball in this manner can be very effective. William Saliba. Teo Hernandez now. Good weight on that pass. Coman. Hernandez. Now Griezmann. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Advantage played. Serge Gnabry. Might really be able to trouble them here. Gnabry. And playing it through. Well, it was easy on the eye, but the interception was made. And the final whistle has sounded. A victory here for France. Stuart, your thoughts on their performance? Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Well, just the sort of performance they were looking for from the talented Kylian Mbappe. Yeah, I think the only thing you could question, could he have been a touch more clinical in front of goal? Maybe should have had two or three today. Regardless of that, it was a good performance and a great result.